This Saturday, it's one of the most exciting days in all of sports with the running of the Kentucky Derby. And the Old Forester Mint Julep, it's the official drink of the Kentucky Derby. Old Forester Master Taster Jackie Zykin has the best job in the world. And he tells us how we can prepare the classic drink from the comfort of our own living rooms. Check this out with Mint Julep. Thank you so much for having me. And you're exactly right. You cannot have a derby without having the julep come to mind, right? It's the official cocktail of the Kentucky Derby. And so you can make it from scratch yourself. It's super simple to do this at home. We start with two ounces of Old Forester bourbon. I'm using the 86 proof. And then three quarters of an ounce of a one-to-one -one simple syrup. Now you can make that at home. You can buy it. It's just dependent on what you'd like to do. Key ingredient, eight to 10 mint leaves into our glass. Now we're gonna muddle those up now, you're not going to pulverize it. You don't want to shred the leaves up. Use a flat bottom muddler and do just a slight push and then turn, just a little press. You just want to bruise them. You don't want to shred them. It'll make it bitter. And then, of course, crushed ice. Crushed ice is key to a mint julep because, as you notice, we didn't stir or shake this. It's just made in the glass. So we need to get our dilution from somewhere or else it's going to be a very, very short race. Straw is key when you have crushed ice, right? And so we're gonna garnish this with fresh mint. It has to be fresh. It has to be green and perky and bright. If it gets freezer burn on it, it turns purple. Don't use that. So you can slap it in your hand. Back of the wrist always works well too. You can clap it. But regardless, you have to sort of beat those leaves up a little tiny bit in order to get those oils to come out. And there you go, right next to the straw. You've done it, you've made a julep. And this is crucial to the Kentucky Derby experience. It is a tradition because much like the wide brim hat, you're blocking the sun, you're getting nice cooling mint for refreshment when you're out there watching the horses race. Now, not only horses race, we also, surprise, have a turtle race going on. The Kentucky Turtle Derby is back for its third year. So information on that can be found at the Old Forester website, oldforester.com slash KTD for Kentucky Turtle Derby. This is a tradition that we brought back from 1945 and now we're in our third year in modern time. So I hope you get a chance to check it out. And happy Derby, please remember to sip responsibly and share it amongst great company and good friends. Cheers.